Hello everyone and welcome to a new tutorial. My name is Dan from Lodi Files and today I'm going to show you how you can add this type of animation into your video stream using Ecamm and Lodi Files. So are you guys ready? Let's begin! Okay, so let's start with Ecamm. Ecamm is a production platform app that will help you to empower your live streams. It has tons of features and actually, you know, you can do things like this. So that's why we are using Ecamm right now. And these type of animations, they are called Lodi animations. So you may be wondering, what is a Lodi? So let me explain. you. Lodi is a new type of format. It's not like a GIF, it's not an MP4, it's a Lodi. And if you compare, for example, with a PNG or a GIF, Lodi is super, super tiny. And the quality, it's amazing because you can see that the quality is vectorized in most of the time. So how to create a Lottie? There are many different ways. You can use After Effects, or you can use also some different apps that we offer, like SVG to Lottie. But in this case, if you would like to learn more, we have three different courses, all for free. And you know, you will learn this probably in two days. And also we have many tutorials in our YouTube channel where you can learn even more. But let's go back to Lottie. So, okay. You don't need right now to worry about creating a lorry or how to use it. Don't worry about it. The only thing you want is probably to add your animation. In this case, you know, I'm adding the logo of my company. So this can actually help you to improve your live streams. Imagine you are in a Zoom call or in a Google Meet call and you have your beautiful logo animated over there. So this is something new and I think a lot of people will love it. So where I can get these lorries? You know, we have our public library. You can download any of these animations. It's for free. It's up to you. At the same time, you have your private library. So the only thing you need to do to access your private library is to create an account and log in. In this case, we just focus on the public library. So you can go to discover free animations. And over here, you will see thousand and thousand of animations. You know, it's incredible how the community and people is adding more and more animations. Actually, you know, every nine seconds, a new load animation is uploaded. So yeah, this is very impressive. For example, uh, I would like to find something about music. So just type here. And oh, again, you know, all this is for free. So for some reason, let's say like, this will be my logo and I would like to add it to my Ecamm. So I will select this one. And you will see like we have, you know, different URLs, but the one that you want is the iframe code. So check on this tab and over here, the only thing you need to do is to copy. So you need to copy the URL. There you go. And we can go back to Ecamm. So over here, what you need to open is the overlays window over here. So the only thing you need to do to click in overlays window, I would just hide this load animation here. And over here, you need to click a new widget. So once you tap out there, just delete this. And we don't need what it says iframe. So yeah, let's make sure to delete this. There you go. And you can name it if you want. If not, not in our case, we'll name it music. And we hit on add widget overlay. So as you can see, we have it over here. Yeah, of course I can put it in my face or I just can remove it. And, you know, let's make it a little bit tiny and let's put it over here. There you go. As simple as that in just a few steps. Now you may be wondering, okay, so what's next? I would like to see this in my Zoom call or maybe in my Google Meet call. Perfect, no problem with that. So the next thing you need to do just to make sure, go to output and then go to virtual cam and make sure that it's on. If it's off, so probably you won't see the virtual cam. And if it's on, you will see like this red icon. Nice. So, you know, if you go to Google Meet, we just can create a new meeting and start an instant meeting here. Just wait for a while. There you go. And as you can see, 
we have our animation over here. And don't worry, you know, some of the times, uh, yeah, the animation is flip, but actually what people will see is the animation in the right way. And what about zoom? So I have zoom here. And the only thing you need to do if we want to test, we just can go, you know, to preferences and let's go to video. There you go. We have our animation. Just make sure that you are selecting Ecamm Live Virtual Cam. So yeah, that's it for today. And if you have any comments or questions, please let us know. We'll be happy to assist you. And don't forget to subscribe and like. So I will see you in the next one. Bye.